We, we have lavished praise upon Hyundai's current generation Tucson compact crossover, which manages to do most things well. Looks are subjective, we know, but the Wagonoid vehicle is fairly handsome, the interior is a model of ergonomic simplicity, and the quality feel is evident. We even found plenty to like in our drive of a front drive base model Tucson SE. The Tucson nails the basics and fails to offend in any major way, and that stays true with the latest version to pass through our hands, the Echo model. Echo As is obvious from its name, the Echo is intended to offer a fuel economy advantage over other Tucsons. Plop into the middle of the Tucson lineup, above the SE but below the flashy Sport and Limited, the Echo uses the 175 horsepower 1.6 liter turbocharged four cylinder engine and seven speed dual clutch automatic from the more expensive models. The base SE has a 164 horsepower 2.0 liter naturally aspirated four with a six speed automatic, with fewer standard features than the Sport and Limited, however, the Echo is lighter. Our all-wheel drive Echo test car was nearly 200 pounds lighter than the Tucson Limited, albeit at the expense of niceties such as a power passenger seat, a panoramic sunroof, and leather. Combine the Echo's weight savings with its smaller 17-inch wheels and tires, which promise lower rolling resistance than the 19-inch setup on the Sport and Limited, and you get the highest EPA fuel economy estimates in the Tucson range. In front drive guys, the Echo is rated at 26 miles per gallon city and 33 miles per gallon highway, with all-wheel drive, it's 25 30 firsts of a mile per gallon. Those numbers range from 2 to 5 miles per gallon better than the SE and 1 to 3 miles per gallon better than those of the Sport and Limited. With the <laughs>